Hi everyone. Um, I was thinking tonight of showing you some uh, some of my drawing pencils, the sketching sets, that kind of thing. Um, I am going to be moving soon, so I was looking through some of my stuff and uh, I noticed that I uh, could use them for a video because they're actually pretty nice. So, first, do the loudest one. information about the pencils in here. Um, home of traditional British uh, pencil making since 1832. Um, so that's that. Sharpen it down, I guess. You just you just peel it. So you can blend very, very um, detailed areas with this. Yeah. It works very well. I mean, you can't always use your pinky, you know. Sometimes you need to get it right in there. Right in the corners. So it works very well. And, um, You have your graphite. These are very heavy. Um, I am actually not exactly sure how to use everything completely properly. <laughs> there is uh, some instructions. So, it's pretty neat. I used this set once. Um, sorry, guys, I say um a lot. So, you have all your pencils here. We'll start from the top. I believe. The different letters and the different, well, not so much the letters, but the numbers. Uh, the higher the number, it represents the softer, the lead. So, that's why an HB is pretty standard, you know. So I'm sure that's what a lot of people have used in school. But the HB.
pretty hard lead. See so how's that one? And then as you go on, yes. See, okay. Um, we have. I don't know if you can see that. See, I can almost. <laughs> this it says it's an HB, but it's a light wash, so it must be a somewhat of a softer lead uh, so this is for your lighter blending your lighter sketching you don't want it to be too dark then you would use something like this it's also soft on the paper too then you have your medium wash your 4b Here's your dark wash. So this is your 8B. This one's pretty. I'm gonna draw all over my hands, but it's, it's pretty, yeah, uh, pretty soft. So that's that one. And then your 9B, which is your soft just lead in this kit anyways. Well, you also have your uh, your 6B and your 3B, so that's how the leads work. If anybody was ever wondering why the, uh, the numbers are on there, that's the information I was given anyways. So correct me if I'm wrong. So it comes with its own little sharpener. And here we have the graphite and the charcoal. And it, was, it says on them. So on the graphite it says hard, medium, and soft. And for the charcoal, it goes the same way. You got your light, medium, and your dark. Now these. These are the neutral colors. We've got terracotta, Venetian red, and brown ochre. Now these remind me of, um, you know, in some photo effects you can see that you can choose the black and white or the sepia. Oh, that's how I pronounce it. So it's almost like a and just a neutral wash of the picture almost makes it look old. So I really like those. Um, here we have a little white eraser. Let's see if I can get it out. It's a little eraser. I prefer the white. Erasers. They also have the um, the clay eraser, which I can show you. So that's I've used a little bit of it, but I do find it smudges quite a bit. But I never knew what this was when I was a kid in art class. I was confused when we were supposed to be sketching and. There was clay on the table. <laughs> it's almost a putty kind of feel to it. So that's what that's for. Just a little. Now, this part's kind of interesting to me. I've never seen these. This, from what I read in the kit, is to take your pencil and you, it's sandpaper, kind of thing. It's all glued together at the end still. But, so, what this is, you take your pencil and you can angle it in a way that um, 
suits you best for whatever you're sketching. This is kind of neat. You know, to sharpen it, it's all the way. It's the same thickness, same shape all the way around. Sometimes you just want a little bit of an angle on it, so. And then here, these are the tinted charcoals. So we have your white, your burnt earth, this is peat, light, medium, and dark. notice every once in a while I'm shaking a little bit. I have a little bit of a tremor, so I hope you don't mind that. This one, I'm going to try and take out of the package. So this is my colored pencil set. It also has, I call them the smudgers. <laughs> so you got your little one, which I find is a lot easier to work with. Just the little one, it's easier to hold. And then you have a longer one. Try and open this package and show you guys. So it's got all the pencil crayons are blendable, which I really, really like. Is, um, the pencils are encased in a thin plastic. Alright, so in this we have an HB pencil, a 2B pencil, a 4B pencil, and six B. So the leads don't get very, very soft in this. Okay, this, this pencil actually feels so neat. It's the woodless pencil. I'm not sure, I'm, sh I'm not sure what it's made of. 
graphite, maybe. It honestly almost feels like porcelain. It's heavy. It's kind of neat. It's pretty soft lead, too. So we got your long smudger, double-ended, and the short one. I love the short one. It's so easy to just get right in there. Works very well for me. And another eraser. There's also a sharpener in this kit. So you got your pink. I'm a little bit colorblind, so I'm going to try my best. I believe that's dark blue. And light orange. And orange. And blue. And yellow. Purple. Green. Black and brown. This one actually, I'm gonna leave it in here. It's pretty noisy. This one actually also comes with some sandpaper. It's called something else in these kits. I'm not exactly sure. Same kind of deal. This one's actually it's softer. Okay. actually going to show you a couple drawings that I found. So, the first one here is, um, I had mentioned before about, um, being into Guild Wars. So what me and my sister did is, um, we took our usernames and we just drew a picture. was mine. I was... I don't remember my race. Anyways, I was a necromancer. And that was, that's what I started with in the game. I liked the darkness of it. And I just... So my name is Dark Damsel. And if you can see. So, there was a lot of dark stuff about it. And White eyes. Loved that about her. That? Okay. That's it for my video. I really need to draw something or paint something in one of these videos, I think. So I've shown you pretty much all of my uh, art supplies. So maybe I'll, maybe I'll do one of those. I gotta think of something to draw. <laughs> maybe you guys can give me some ideas. So, I wish you all a great night. And I will talk to you later.